Well, the rain offering a short window of relief for crews on the Caldor Fire, now 76% contained. They're hoping to build on that overnight because these good conditions won't last long. CBS 13's Laura Hafley is live along Highway 50 with crews trying to take advantage, Laura, of the rainfall. Well, for weeks, fire crews have been driving along Highway 50 East, racing to contain the Caldor Fire, which is so close to that 100% containment mark. Moving into the overnight hours, crews are hoping some wet weather will help them get there. Fire crews are kicking into high gear. We're not uh, relaxing at all. After a hot few weeks, rain and moisture are on the horizon. Welcomed weather for Caldor Fire crews. We will take advantage of the humidities and the rain. But the forgiving conditions won't last long. It's a race against time to boost containment. We're expecting humidity overnight to move up into the 70 to 90 percent range. We asked Caldor Fire meteorologist Sean Palmquist how that helps the firefight. Uh, it'll help moderate the fire behavior. And so they can actually get out on the line, suppress things if necessary. The mixture of heat, rain, and maybe even snow isn't uncommon for fall. Can't rule out, you know, a few snowflakes mixing in, especially this time of year. You see big swings in weather. Which could continue to make fire season unpredictable as wildfires continue to burn across California. When they all happen at once, that really kind of hurts us. Robert Chapanik says 100% containment on the Caldor Fire means more resources for the state. Once we kind of get a, a good handle of this fire, then we start releasing equipment. A welcome sight for evacuees who are looking forward to their towns returning to normal. I'm hoping and praying um, it would absolutely be a blessing. And we asked experts about the potential for mudslides with rain in the forecast and plenty of burned areas. It is a possibility, but extremely unlikely as the rain is not expected to last that long. All right, Laura, thank you. Let's get